Clear for up. Morning. May 31st, and it's chilly as all good out down here, man. Going up for a little funsies. Got company this morning. We got Mike and JC draw here. We're all going out. I gotta go out to runway 9 or let's check the winds again. They were easterly a minute ago. Altimeter 3032. Remarks. Density altitude 100. Shelbyville Municipal Airport. Shelbyville, Indiana. Automated weather observation 1049er Zulu. Wind 100 at 04. Visibility 9er. Sky condition clear. Temperature 11 Celsius. Dew point 08 Celsius. Altimeter 3032. Remarks. Density altitude 100. Shelbyville Municipal Airport. Shelbyville, Indiana. Automated weather observation 1049er Zulu. Wind 100 at 04. That's a good wind. I'll take that. One one zero, that'll work for me. I can do that. Yeah, GC's up. Shelbyville traffic, power and parachute. Niner Mike Pappas parked in the northwest corner of runway Niner off to the edge out of the way. We'll be away from the radio for 10 minutes to lay out our parachute for departure, Shelbyville. Clear for up. Shall we go traffic? Experimental power parachute 72 Niner Mike Papa departing runway Niner in the grass, leaving the area to the south after departure. Shall we go? Back to 
fly with me. Who knows? They don't have radios, so shit. wasn't boring after all, huh? Just never know. Pick up now and do some shenanigans or something. Catch this road. about the same speed. Oh, he's got a freaking speed bar. He's cheating. I see his legs out. Looks like he's got a speed bar, maybe. What a douche. Oh, he's got freaking push to pass. Not fair. Drop down this field, shenanigans. On the deck, babies.
Yeah, my wife watched that the other night. Moist down there in spots. Moist. said this was going to be boring. I never said that. I said no such thing. Oh, damn. 
Justin Prince. Whiskey Delta, hold for release. Hold for release. 212 Whiskey Delta. Columbus Tower 8, Niner 6, Papa Sierra is on a two mile right base for 2 3. Runway 9 or 6, Papa Sierra, roger. Runway 23, you're cleared to land. Traffic Mooney taking runway for departure. Clear to land, and uh, we're looking for the traffic. 8 or 6, Papa Sierra. Number 2, Whiskey Delta. Runway 23 at Bravo, 3,240 feet remaining. You're cleared for takeoff. Climb maintain 5,000. Proceed on course. Runway 23 at Bravo, clear for takeoff. Uh, left on course, and up to 5,000. 2, 1, 2, Whiskey Delta. M2 Whiskey Delta, traffic on about a two mile, gonna be turning about a two mile final. Got to fight all of it here. Columbus Tower, this is Experimental Fire Parachute 739er Mike Papa. Number 739er Mike Papa, Columbus Tower, go ahead. Uh, this is 729er Mike Papa, we are five miles to your east, just outside of the Class Delta. Request uh, touch and go on runway 32 and an orc departure if possible. Number 729er Mike Papa, Roger, and you said to you to the south, uh, southeast? We are due east. Uh, 1,000 feet at 30 knots. Number 729 or Mike Papa, roger. And um, you can uh, expect runway 32, wind calm, altimeter is 3035. Uh, enter a right base and uh, report entering that base for me, please. About two mile right base, if you will. Report two mile right base for runway 329 or Mike Papa. Two zero Papa Whiskey, which direction are you going to be heading out? Two zero Papa Whiskey is headed southwest. Thank you. <laughs> and we're ready for departure. November two zero Papa Whiskey and Roger, runway two three cleared for takeoff, southwest departure approved. Two three cleared for takeoff, two zero Papa Whiskey. Seven two nine, Mike Pop. I do have you inside. If you just want to come straight in from your position to the base for a runway three two, that's fine. You don't have to maneuver out two miles. Thank you very much. We'll go straight in for a right base for runway three two. Seven two nine, Mike Pop. Seven two nine, Mike Pop. Runway three two, runway three two, runway three two, seven two nine, Mike Pop. We'll do the other runway this time. <coughs> we'll head over toward Edinburgh from the way out. Delta to the south. 22 Papa Whiskey for exchange proof. You have a good, good flight. Thank you. Well, the way down here, my 
guys. We'll do Columbus, huh? Papa, where are you based out of? We're out of Shelbyville. Okay. I see a lot of uh, those power parachutes flying in and out of Franklin. Yeah, they got a power paraglider school over there. I flew down with Shelbyville, from Shelbyville with one this morning. There's a hot air balloon out to the east here, and we chased it down. Yeah, he also flew flew into the airspace a little bit there. Number nine, Mike Papa, uh, runway three two, wind calm, and cleared for the option. Runway three two, cleared for the option, nine, Mike Papa. And number nine, Mike Papa, after the option, say attentions. We're going to exit up to the northbound toward Edinburgh and then north from there. Number 9 Mike Papa, Roger. Right turn out approved. Right turn out after departure, 9 Mike Papa. Papa, report leaving the class Delta. Report leaving the class Delta, Niner Rock Papa.
Uh, Columbus Tower, uh, over 4506 Tango on the ramp. Number 4506 Tango, uh, Columbus Tower, go ahead, sir. Uh, zero 06 Tango is uh, ready to taxi. We'll be uh, southeast bound. And Piper 06 Tango, runway 23, wind calm. Altimeter is 3035. Taxi via Alpha and cross runway 14 at Alpha. Runway 23 will uh, go by Alpha and cross over 3 Niner 6 Niner Papa Golf is a Cirrus SR20, 15 north at 3,500 inbound full stop with the weather. Number Niner 6 Niner Papa Golf, Columbus Tower. Roger, how far north are you? 15 north. Number Niner Papa Golf, Roger. Runway 23, wind calm. Optimus 3035, enter and report a right base. Right base for 23, Niner 6 Niner Papa Golf. Number Niner Mike Papa, say altitude. Okay, November 9 or Mike Papa, say altitude. 9 or Mike Papa is 1,100 feet. Thank you. November 9 or Papa Golf, traffic is a power parachute at uh, 1,100 feet heading towards the north. 9 or 6, 9 or Papa Golf. November 9 or Mike Papa, traffic is a Cirrus coming in from the north there. He's uh, about 12 north right now. We'll keep an eye out for him, 9 or Mike Papa. Fun. Fun being in the Delta, man. Something different, you know? Just gotta do it. Now for the Cirrus. You know those Cirrus pilots. Get a little spunky, 830. Keep our eyes out for him. Stay low. He won't be this low. I hope. Tango runway 23 cleared for takeoff, left turn out approved. Uh, 23 cleared for takeoff, left hand turn, 06 Tango. Columbus Tower, power parachute, Niner Mike Popper is clear of the Delta to the north. Remember Niner Mike Popper for exchange approved. Me you enjoy your flight. Thank you very much. Papa Golf, uh, Mermway 23, you're clear to land, traffic Cherokee on departure roll. 23, clear to land, 969 or Papa Golf.
Last two flights in a row to the Delta. And a touch and go at the airport. Different runway, well, same runway, opposite direction, but technically a different runway. Now we'll head on back home, I gotta pee. Been up an hour and 37 minutes. This will be a two hour flight. Wonder if Dave was listening. So cool, so much fun. That's a whole new dimension to flying when you can fly into a little different airspace. Pretty cool. Now let's go have some more fun. Gina Fisher up here. Um, they uh, got a little airport. I may try to land there. I gotta go to the bathroom, so we'll pop up there and we're due south of it now. We'll just head north and. See how the winds are for departure. I could land, I know, no problem, but taking off again, so let me just do that. I'm gonna go land at Cardinal's Nest Airport, 58 II. They're gonna rename it Eagle's Nest, so. Doesn't look like they've done that yet. I can use their facilities. Airport inside. <coughs> What's the CTAF for their airport here? Oh wait, they don't have one. Hopefully I can get this thing off the ground again. But the bladder's gonna win out on landing.
got to pee. <laughs> We were gonna joke about you can just pull an astronaut move and wear a depend. Yeah, I could. Country. Rest yeah. area five. I was like, yeah, I'll fly over that way just for kids. Yeah. <laughs> I probably could have made it, but I would have been uncomfortable. Right. <laughs> <laughs> been up about two hours. So. Oh, oh wow, that's uh, a nice long time. Yeah. Where you been? Good to see you. Good to see you. <laughs> so glad you came in. Good to see we'll, you. We'll, we'll take you straight to the restroom. Yeah. Morning. Morning. Morning, you can't tell we just woke up. Yeah. 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 We're like, kids, uh, wake up. Scott's coming. Uh, Scott, you've met Scott. Scott, you've yes. met Scott. Scott, 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 Scott. Scott. Yeah, come on in. Hey, Scott. Bumble. Are you threatening me? Are you threatening me? <laughs> Tony with the call back. That was pretty good. Bung <laughs> hole. Yeah, we should have sent you home with a complimentary uh, roll of TP. <laughs> yeah. In fact. <laughs> I may look funny, but I'm warm. <laughs> yep. No, that's good. Actually, I need to find a, a face wrap like that. Yeah. Keeps my neck warm. Yeah. When I ride the motorcycle, I have the same same problem. Air, air gets underneath the underneath the helmet and my neck is frozen. The worst part is too if you haven't shaved in a while. Oh right. That chin strap catches the nubs and yeah. it hurts. Ouch. Yeah, that hurts after a while. I could have turned my intercom off, but I didn't. What's that? Yeah, it's right here. Fishers, thank you for the bathroom facilities. <laughs> My bladder and I thank you profusely.
back there. Real wet. When the gyro burps up. Nope, no burp. Zulu. Wind one seven zero at zero five. Show me all traffic fire parachute. Now my pop is a half mile west at one thousand feet on a right base for the grass at the north end of Taxiway Bravo. Show me all. Eagle Creek, anybody in a pattern for 2 1? God, everybody's talking over each other this morning, man. Show me one traffic, power parachute, 9 Mike pop out, turning final for the grass at the north end of Taxiway Bravo to the south. Show me one. Eagle Creek, Conquest is turning into left base 2 1, Eagle Creek. Eagle. Get much better than that. Right in a big clump of grass here. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was a good trip. I don't know if this audio is working on this other camera because last time it screwed up so I'm going to pop this other one off. So great flight this morning. Uh, Memorial Day. Thanks to all the servicemen who gave the ultimate sacrifice for us. That's the first thing. Um, got up this morning and had Curtis and Mike out here at the airport <clears throat> for a morning flight. Didn't know they were going to be here. It's always a nice surprise. So they got off the ground ahead of me. I don't know which camera to look at. I'll put them both together. Looks like eyes looking at me. Anyway, we flew south. The wind was out of the south, so I caught up with them a little bit south of town, and we went on down over the quarries around Flat Rock down there, and then Curtis and I flew on south. I don't know. Mike must have turned around and went back or something. He was slowed up. Curtis looks like he had a speed bar on his paraglider, so uh, he was able to keep up and actually pull ahead of me, so that was cool. Went south to Hope, we saw a hot air balloon down there and we chased after it, but unfortunately it landed before we got there. So uh, we did a few circles around it and some shenanigans and checked it out and I decided to go ahead and fly over to uh, Columbus Airport and do another touch and go, work the tower. So I called in and they were a little busy, but not too bad. So he worked me in, did a nice little touch and go there and then back up north to home and I had to go to the bathroom <laughs> real bad and I wanted to fly over to our lake and stuff. So I landed at the Fishers at Cardinals Nest Airport 58II and they gave me some cake they had a graduation yesterday Her son graduated from high school and gave me some cake and more importantly I got to use their facilities which was awesome talk with them a little bit and fortunately the wind was right out of the south so it made for an easy departure on their grass strip they have a north south grass strip and then just did a uh, little quick pass over our lake it was a little skyhawk 152 rather 
did a pass over our lake, my aunt and her husband, and circled over their cabin on the other side of the lake from us and over our house and up toward Fairland and back here. So great flight. It's about 10, 13 in the morning. We got off the ground about seven, a little bit after. So good long morning. So hopefully we'll try this again tonight. Uh, Nulltown Fly-On is next weekend. Nulltown Wingnuts, look them up. Uh, June weekend of the 4th, so I'm going to fly this over there tonight. <coughs> I'll probably take my son Alex with me, fly over. It's a one-way, be a one-way trip, about an hour flight, so we may do a little more dicking around and just have my wife pick us up over there and bring us home. That way I have my machine pre-positioned for the fly-in next weekend. I don't have to haul it over there on the trailer, which is a pain. It's more fun to fly it anyway. He wants to pull it on a trailer. So anyway, done with that, and we'll go ahead and get this thing fueled up, get back home. we got to visit all the cemeteries and for our relatives and put flowers out so that's our plan this afternoon um, before we i got a worm on my camera check this out you can see him little dude there's a couple of them or no just no there's two of them that's pretty wild check it out crazy do 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 he's a wiggler yeah you're going not here dude <sighs> hopefully i don't have any of those guys in my parachute so anyway signing off see you bye